Yeah, what is going on everybody and welcome to Mary's Arcade. Uh, my name is Minus Lee here and today this is a new FNAF game that came about, I want to say like five months ago. So let's go ahead and jump in, shall we? Local restaurant is looking to hire a security guard to work the night shift from 12 a.m. to 6 a.m. No degree or prior experience required. Must be reliably easy to work. Email us at jobs at maryarcade.com if interested. Oh, click continue. Okay. Oh, my bad. First shift. Midnight. <laughs> Time passes slightly faster when your laptop's down. Have one new message. Hi there. Um, I thought I'd call to help you get settled in on your first shift. Um, I actually started out at a Mary's too, you know. Um, it was a while ago at a different building, but still, I know what it's like in there. Um, I should probably fill you in on some of the things we're working on right now. Uh, this place is in the middle of getting a much needed facelift. Um, if you think it looks outdated now, you should have seen this place a few weeks ago. Um, so far, we've installed all new arcade machines, new kitty rides, a new ball pit, new toilets, everything. Um, you should be able to see some of those on the cameras. Uh, we've spent a small fortune on all this stuff. Um, ooh, I'm, I'm getting ahead of myself here. Uh, let's see. Um, welcome to Mary's Arcade, a magical place where childhood memories are made, where people of all ages can find something to enjoy. Mary's Arcade is not responsible for any damage to property or injuries that occur on or around playtime equipment or by our animatronic mascots, blah blah blah, all of that legal stuff. Um, oh, speaking of our mascots though, you should probably be aware that they can walk around. I know, I know, sounds dumb, but I'm being serious. Um, they used to let them walk around all the time, but the technology just wasn't good enough back then, and there were too many complaints and lawsuits. Um, but. As part of the new modern image for the company, the owners want to let them walk around during the daytime and interact with customers again. Um, we're still in the process of doing safety tests though, so in the meantime they can only walk around at night. Um, they're set to travel in circles around the place, so that does mean at some point they'll pass pretty close to you. Um, you should be totally safe in there, but the last guy insisted that sometimes instead of passing by the office, they would just stand by the windows and stare at him. Now, uh, I think he was messing with us, but if he was telling the truth, then that could be serious. If they're back there for too long, they might bump into something important and knock out the power. Now, uh, that wouldn't be good for you or them, so if you see them standing there, you're going to have to get them out of there and back on track. Now, uh, if you look above the map on your display, you'll see two little buttons we hooked up to each room. These act as simple remote controls for the mascot, so we can take over if need be. Um, if you play the buzzer on a mascot, it'll be frozen in place until the sound stops. Uh, the PA system there is a bit more complicated. If you play it one zone in front of a mascot, it'll come to that room. Only forwards though, not backwards. Um, so on the off chance that you do see a mascot outside the rear window, try pulling it past the office. Um, that's not too bad, right? Um, hey, watch those recharge times carefully though, alright? Good night. Alright, since that's done, let's talk about what we gotta do. So basically, they're gonna go through 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7, and 8, and 9, and back to 2, I'm guessing. Which is understandable, the budget stops them. And then I'm guessing the PA. Yes, that is correct. Okay, see? I got it. Now we can buzzer them. Buddy, I'm dead. Do you want to face me? How dare you come into my office? I was just testing this out. You want to fight me? Maybe not right now. Bruh, bruh, bruh. Hey. And I'm dead. And I was not. I screwed myself over. And I'm going to try again. Hey, buddy! Or girl. I don't know what you are. I'm gonna name you Nanny McPhee because apparently you're a maid, obviously. I don't know. Shit, you got some cookies, though. You want the chocolate? 
Oh, I'd like some cookies. Oh, you gone? Ah, oh, you're there now. Ah, oh, you're in the kitchen. Okay. You wanna cook us something? Oh, I'm just kidding. You got a girl. You're a girl. I can tell you're a girl. You got a man dressed in a suit tie over there. Hey, buddy. Hey. I'm hearing thumps. Hey, buddy, you know what? There you go, buddy. We're just gonna leave you right there. Yep, see, there we go. Easy pie. This night will be easy as done as quickly as possible. Oh, 6 a.m.? No? Oh. I'm sorry, what? Now we did it! Yo! Yeah! Yay! Time for children to come. Oh. Hi again. Did you see the mascots walking around at all last night? Told you I wasn't lying. They didn't want me to tell you that yesterday. They like to scare the new guys by leaving that part out. So just be glad you got me recording these for you and not that smelly weirdo Mike. Last time he trained a new guy, they... You know what, never mind. Um, anyway, I forgot to tell you yesterday that there's something else you can do from that room. Um, if you tap and hold on either of those windows, they'll actually turn on a light outside the office. Um, when the mascots are in nighttime mode, any bright light will practically blind them. So that should slow them down substantially. Um, you can do that if the PA system is still recharging and you need to buy yourself more time. Um, that, that should work as long as the light doesn't get too dim, of course. Uh, so watch that battery. Um, also, speaking of the mascots in nighttime mode, it turns out that they might not properly recognize you as an employee in the dark. So, um, they probably think you're a customer who wandered into a staff area, or an intruder. Heck, they might even think you're a costumeless mascot. But if they get to you, they'll probably try to forcefully detain you, to put it lightly. Um, hey, if they do get into that room, try going limp. They might not recognize you as a person at all in that case. So, then they might think you're an empty costume and try to take you apart. Uh, you, you know what? Don't do that. Just keep them out of there, alright? Be safe. Uh, okay. As you can see what's happening now, apparently they could go either way, not in a separate order, which bloody sucks and I don't like that at all. And you're gone. Let me see if I got this right. Okay, you flash the light on him and all that stuff. And then... This is why I like it. <gasps> You're not supposed to be here! Who the hell are you? PA system, PA system, PA system! Come on, come on, come on, I'm dead. I'm doing something wrong. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Want to see a magic trick? I'm sorry, what? No, hold up. You can't shut down the cameras like that. No. What am I supposed to do? You can't shut cameras down like that without telling me that. How 
about another? Ah, oh, shit, I'm fucked. No. No. Okay. What's going on? Why are all my cameras shutting down? What in the world? There was no explanation unless I missed it in the phone call. But that's highly impossible. It's 5 a.m., but that doesn't matter. Sorry, you literally caught me off by surprise. I'm blind. Uh, no, screw the 6 a.m. Yeah! Alright. Let's see what Third Night brings to us and then we can call this a day. And then we can do everything else, which is just fine. Okay, system's fine. Can I make it? Probably not. You know. Oh, say yes, say. Oh, I'm dead. I'm so dead. Oh. No. Hey. Buddy, ah, crap, it's Freddy Fun the Bear. Freddy Fun the saying it was well I don't know what the story is I don't know what anything about this game I don't know why Nanny V is here I don't know why the wolf is in an outfit I don't know what's with the raccoon and the tie in the suit but I will tell you this though I will be going back to this game it's very fun I will see y'all next time. Maybe like and subscribe. It will help me with the channel. I'll see y'all later.